Hey, welcome to my channel. My name is Shauna. I'm an adult doll collector and my videos are for other adults. Today I'm going to be looking at these two new fashionistas. I bought these dolls at Target this morning. They are beautiful needs. This is number 228 and she is the first Barbie that is uh, blind. And uh, you can see she has her little cane and it says AFB, which stands for the American Foundation for the Blind. And it says expanding possibilities for people with visual loss. And there is even some braille at the bottom, vision loss. And then over here is the second Barbie to have Down syndrome. Last year I did pick up the first one. I can't remember her number, but I do have a review on her. I will leave a link for that one in the description. And Mattel partnered with the National um, excuse me, the National Down Syndrome Society to make this doll. And this one comes with glasses. They're both so beautiful. I'm going to take them out of the box and give you a better look at them. So here are the Barbies out of their boxes and I think they look even better out of the box. I put them on some stands that I got from Amazon recently. On the left, I believe this is 228. She has what I'd call medium skin and some glasses that she comes attached to her head. I'll have to remove those. Her hair is brown with some highlights. You get a couple of shades of brown in there. She has brown eyes and soft um, kind of rosy lips. Her outfit is so cute. Both of the dolls have really cute outfits. This one has kind of a pink color um, little crop top. The skirt is purple and you can see it has ruffles with glitter on it. She is articulated at the elbows and she can hold her own mobility cane. Okay, and you can see, here it is. She can hold it herself. And then she has some matching little purple heels. Uh, she is the traditional height of Barbie. And 229 has a dark skin, some tight braids, tiny little braids. She is a shorter doll and is the curvy figure. She has hot pink glasses for her brown eyes and a nice smile. Her dress is a shade of blue, very pretty with blue on, you know, blue on blue hearts and some yellow hearts there. The dress is top stitched in that hot pink and then there are some matching um, hot pink little high tops for her. Both girls are beautiful. As I was editing this video and I was mentioning her dress, I guess I left off the part about the three arrows. I think it's because I didn't see um, these little chevron arrows in her dress. Um, I'm starting to need to use glasses when I read and I didn't even notice them looking through the lens of my camera. But on my computer screen, I saw them and if you're wondering what they are, and I found out last year, is those little arrows represent the copies of the, you know, three copies of the 21st chromosome, which causes Down syndrome. So how nice that this was included in the pattern of her dress. Here's a look at both of the girls from the side. You can see how long their hair is. And I forgot to mention when I was looking at this Barbie that she does have some little painted on edges, which is always a nice touch. And I don't know if anybody has watched, um, this Barbie that is the first visually impaired Barbie reminded me of a show I was watching on Netflix recently, a couple of years ago actually, In the Dark. It has three or four seasons, I think. Let me know if you ever saw it. It was really good and the main character uh, was blind. She had um, a cane and also a dog and um, I really liked her dog. Anyway, let me know if you saw the show. I really enjoyed it. So when this doll came out, I immediately thought of the show and every time I look at this doll, I think of the main character. I want to thank you so much for watching and please be sure to check back soon for more videos. My Instagram accounts are Sofa Dolls and Pink Chic Barbie. Let me know. So let me know, are you going to be adding either of these beautiful dolls to your collection? Thank you so much for watching and come back soon for more videos. Bye-bye.